welcome to my space. <laughs> kitchen, kitchen, dining, sala, workspace. Thank you. <laughs> again to another episode so here we are in my space so i'm gonna show you a quick uh, tour of my new space okay sobrang simple lang niya very functional yung design ng space upon entrance dahil pandemic tayo guys so dapat lagi may alcohol spray lahat ng mga pangdinis it helps na may access ako sa inventory ng common room. Dahil marami kayong makikita dito na pinitas ko sa shelves ng common room. Ito, galing kay Punchcraft. Ito, mga stuff ni Luna Maya. Simoy ng Haraya. This is from uh, Studio No. 3. Ito rin. <laughs> Bags of Robert Tree. So, like mga quick access. Dalagyan na ng face shield, mask, and then everything else. Yes, moving in. To my kitchen. Moving out of my kitchen. <laughs> uh, okay, so ito very functional lang din siya. Wala hong bago masyadong binili. But, future project ko kasi sobrang baba nito. Lagi ako nauuntog, guys. <laughs> Pang naguhugas ako. Yung headroom niya, non-existent. So, lagi ako nauuntog dito. And my coffee, please! May ako sa kape. So, a lot of these are actually local beans from Trails and Traces. Nag-rotate lang ako ng mga beans na ito try. Ay, na-hoard ko yung mga things na I like, which are coffee, kaya dami yung mga coffee beans and books. So, all throughout the space, makikita nyo mga iba-iba kong stash ng books and plants. So, ito, hindi ko pa alam kung anong gagawin ko sa kanya, but now, it's just really storage. Lahat ng mga plant stuff ko. Hindi yan beer, guys. <laughs> Land, spray, mga insecticide, organic insecticide, or pesticide. Super little storage. Lahat ng sapatos ko na sandals, nandito lang po is. <laughs> Kasi hindi naman ako maraming sapatos. And since I have limited space, I make sure na I had to declutter and isisiksik ko lang yung super essentials are here also. All my crafting, art prints, Nandiyan siya. Like mga appliance stuff. Electronics nandiyan lang siya. Compact and small. Dining space! Again, inimagine ko yung space ko. I really wanted to have friends over. That's why maraming seating options. But, I don't have friends. <laughs> Bawal yung friends eh. So, inimagine ko na sila somewhere. So again, ito are actually old common room stools in Katipunan. Ninakaw ko lang. Sabi ko, ate, akin na lang kasi wala akong budget. So, but these are um, pinacustomized ko siya. So, ito yung recent upgrade ko sa kanya. And then this one, again, since I have limited space. It's actually storage for my other shoes. See? Konta lang. Functional. Ito, guys, si Kuya Budoy ang gumawa. And then, more common room stuff. And ito are lights from my old unit na. That's the dining. This is my living area. Again, yung sofa, sobrang sakto lang niya sa space. So, perfect na siya. But, I had to have it re-upholstered kasi hindi siya ganun ka-comfy. So, hindi ko rin masyado na-enjoy. So, before buying new things, kasi I ko consider ko na talaga bumili ng bagong sofa, but I had to look for another option just to repair it. So, again, tip yun. So, before buying new things, baka naman pwede nyo siyang i-repair. Kasi sobrang fit naman siya sa space. Sayang yung structure kasi okay pa naman siya. It's just kailangan lang niya ng upgrade. And then, as you can see, Ang major design element ko talaga is halaman. <laughs> Wala akong mga artworks and all. Marami akong art prints as collections, but I keep them. Maybe for another day. So, makikita nyo na talaga are my plants and my books. And common room stuff. <laughs> so, this is my living room and then we move on to my workspace. So, sobrang tempo lang siya. 
when we went to SM, nakita ko siyang bar table. But yung size niya, actually sakto lang siya dun sa sa arm ko. So very ergonomic na siya for me. So I actually prefer standing up when I'm working kasi nalilesen yung pag-slouch ko. And then I just bought a razor for my laptop para at least um, I level ko yung uh, monitor ko. So it's very easy for me to work lessening yung back strain ko because I'm slouching. So I mostly like that. And yan, kita. And pag nagsistress ako, humumuni-muni na ako ganyan. Bakit ba ganito yung mga clients ko? Ganun. <laughs> Again, plants. So, sila yung kausap ko pag nasa-stress ako. And yung windowsill ko, medyo tinransform ko na siya into my propagation station. Dahil may space, may plants. <laughs> so, <laughs> lahat ng pinapropagate ko, the little things, yan, dito ko sila nilalagay by the window. And again, we move up. <laughs> Plant tour ba to or condo tour? Ayan. So, mirror. Nilagay ko lang siya dyan. Pero technically, nakocover na siya ng halaman. So, upper half lang ay nakikita ko. And we go to my bedroom. Basta may space, may plants. Kaya ang stairs, puro plants. Okay. Exercise actually na may stairs. Kasi pag akit baba ako, Yun na yung pinaka step counter ko for the day. I like this part. Basta my space, my plans. <laughs> so, yun. Anything na hanging, nilagay ko. Ay, ang ganda. Sige. So, pinupuno ko lang siya. Again, design element ko talaga is mostly plants. This is my room. Again, wala kang masyadong binili sa kanya. Kasi nung nagde-design nga kami, I wanted to minimize yung mga bagong bibilhin. So, ito, galing na siya sa old condo. Itong mirror na to was actually yung cover ng cabinet. Pero nahuhulog siya. As in, natatanggal siya. So, medyo delikado. So, we just covered this. Yung old curtain ko, ginawa ko na lang siya pang cover ng cabinet. And then, allergic kami sa nagtatapon ng mga bagay na functional pa. <laughs> So, we kept na lang the sliding doors from the cabinet and then ginawa ko na siyang mirror. Sayang din naman kasi, again, we were minimizing additional expenses during the time. Yung dati kong work table, ginawa ko na lang siyang side table. And then, my family, my friends. So, every morning, I say hi to them. So, this is my bed. <laughs> Sobrang comfy niya. The actual mattress itself, hindi siya malambot. Kasi hindi pwede sa likod ko yung sobrang lambot na mattress. So, medyo firm siya. But, what I did was I invested in a bed topper. So, thick. It's very thick. It's very malambot for my back. But at the same time, yung mattress ko firm pa rin. Ang mga 5 to 7 hours of your day also, you spend sleeping. And the more stressful the, your work is, parang dapat mas refreshing talaga yung tulog nyo. So, again, it's best invest in mga long-term life improvement things. Like better bed or better pillow. Kasi sobra lagi talaga ang stiff neck. So, better bed and better pillows! And guys, itong sheets na to, super lambo. So, matutulog na talaga ako. <laughs> yung dating owner, yung bed niya nasa gitna. Ang weird kasi ang sike. para it cuts off yung flow or yung galaw ng tao. So, I made, we made it a point na lang na mas may space para to move. So, sinagad na lang namin siya sa bed. Ay, sa side. Ang hirap lang dito, pag nakakalimutan ko i-close yung window sa umaga, parang, <laughs> sobrang, sobrang bright niya na magigising ka talaga. So, yun. One big design consideration din. What is important for you? For the life that you want to have? And then, design around it. Laking bagay na sayo yung place. This is a place where I'll imagine myself growing old in. Ano ba yung kinds ng habits or daily routines na I really want to cement in my space. And that also helps me decide how I want to design it. I know na my place is not so big, pero para it's flexible enough na I can still work out, 
has enough space for all my green baby plants. It's a place na you can design your ideal life around. So that's what's really exciting for me. Kung before, very temporary yung mga purchases ko. Ngayon yung mga projects ko sa kanya, medyo mas long term. Mas nag invest ako dun sa mga bagay na mas may enjoy ko in the long run. And hindi ko na kailangan madaliin. Siguro yung next project ko would be my cabinets, yung banyo, yung banyo yung pinaka neglected part dito. <laughs> Sobrang basic lang niya, but eventually, you know, pwede ko siyang gawing long term project ko. Ang saya lang kasi you can actually look forward to more things in the future. Na hindi lang siya meantime purchases or meantime changes because you know na it's a place that you want to grow into. And that's it, diba? Sobrang quick tour lang siya of the space. But actually, marami pa akong gusto nang i-share sa inyo about my experiences and my thoughts about getting the space and moving in my new condo during the new normal and the pandemic. So, Hope you guys stay and share your thoughts and comments as well in the section below. See ya!